Hasim Rahman Jr., Greg Hardy Jr., crazy. Um, Hasim Rahman Jr. was supposed to be fighting someone else. I don't know who that was. I really wasn't interested in this fight, to be honest, but a friend of mine told me to check the fight out. I checked it out early this morning. Um, Rahman Jr., he needs a lot of work, really not a heavyweight, but he's fighting a heavyweight, so he got to learn how to, for one, keep his hands up, tighten up, I mean, stay behind his jab. You know what I mean? Just be an all-around smarter fighter, sharper fighter. This guy was a monster, though. I give him I give him credit for getting in there with the guy. The guy was 320 pounds, 6'5". He was a giant, um, a, a mammoth. You know what I mean? I, I don't know what else to call it. You know what I mean? And, and, and you got to know with a guy like that, you're not going to just knock him out. You're not going to just back him up. You got to go in there outsmarting. He kind of gave up after the first round, got caught with a good shot. In the second round, got knocked down. Greg Hardy actually finished the fight impressively with keeping his distance and staying behind his jab, looking like he was the better fighter. Um, it's crazy because he was 1-0 going into the fight. He's now 2-0 with one knockout. Rockman Jr. was 12-1, now 12-2. I mean, it's kind of a letdown to lose to a guy like that, especially a guy who, who was once a former football player. Crazy. Um, but it is what it is. That's the sport. I mean, it's, it's boxing, it's fighting, it's one-on-one -on -one combat, so these things can happen. These things have to happen. I mean, I feel like Rockman just needs some tightening up to do. You know what I mean? He got to really realize that he's a heavyweight now. You know what I mean? And, you know, you're not your father, so, you know what I mean? The power is not the same, but, and the size isn't the same. He's not as big as his father, but, you know what I mean? You are a heavyweight, so you got to tighten up. My boy, Greg Hardy, on the other end, Greg Hardy might have a future in uh, boxing with beating Rockman Jr. That's going to give him a lot of confidence. Um, and he got Shannon Briggs helping him out. So, I mean, we might see this guy again. He might actually become, you know, a top guy because he has the size to do it. But with the age, you know what I mean? He's fighting with the age right now. Being only 34, he's going to have to do a lot of fighting to get up there. And I believe he's going to get a lot of offers now because, you know what I mean, being televised, fighting on the zone and getting his second win against a guy that was 12-1 and one, looks great on his record. So, you know what I mean? It's, it's just, this shit is just crazy. The game is getting crazier and crazier, but I ain't going to lie. It's entertaining at times. Um, if you want to hit me up personally, you can hit me up Greg Hackett 86 on Instagram, Greg Hackett on Facebook, and Greg Hackett 215 on Twitter. I appreciate y'all for tapping in. Like, share, subscribe. Get with me later. You know what I mean? Any opinions you want to drop, go ahead and send them to me, and I'll make sure I check them out. Thank you.